I'm 38 years old. This is my second time in prison. Uh, let's see, I've been in prison now for a little over 15 years, and I have 16 months till I get out. Today's event was reaching out from within. It was guys from Lansing Correctional Facility coming to visit with our students and just sharing their st stories, talking about their childhood, what brought them to prison, and really just um, impacting the kids' lives that they could see and kind of hear what, what it's like to go to prison and then how that can impact your life in, in a negative way. I've been in prison for 22 years. When I was 19, I was sentenced to life for felony murder. I hope that the students will understand in the depths of their being how many people are in prison spending 20, 25, 35 years of their life because they made a poor choice when they were 17, 18, and 19. And if they do nothing else but say to themselves, what can I learn from these men who are willing to expose themselves to share anything and everything? How can I use this to make sure that I don't end up in prison? The thing I, I, I really note about reaching out from within is when we get together and we talk about things, it's kind of uh, startling how similar a lot of our stories are. I think that's what it took for me to kind of get out of my shell, was like recognizing that I wasn't just alone or the only one feeling through those things or going through those same issues. And when you find uh, some common ground with some people, you can kind of let that stuff go. And I think uh, that's one thing that I've been able to do is, is, is let some of those issues go by finding the solidarity with, with people. And it's been the same with uh, some of these kids that I, I've talked to who are one step to being where I'm at, and that's not a place you want to be. I thought, you know, it was kind of cool, you know, to hear from a different perspective of other people, you know, that have actually been in this situation to, you know, speak to other children, you know, other kids, high school, you know, people just in general and tell them, you know, what it actually is, what it actually does to you and what, you know, what it could, what could happen. I felt like I don't want to do anything bad like them because I don't want to be in prison. And they, they really spoke to me and they got to me saying that, like, it's kind of the worst thing you probably ever want to do. Ever. I think these types of events are important to Jersey because they're real world. It's, it's what these kids are dealing with. It's real world applicable, you know? And I think when, when you have that, learning really occurs because kids can translate from A to B, you know? So I'm really excited that here at Shawnee Mission, you know, that the kids have a chance to get kind of a wide array of those kind of skills and those kind of opportunities.